start right from the beginning again, right? Good. Okay, uh, as you can see here, we we're showing how you put together the low profile wall termination. Um, you can see there's a left and a right side. You can choose to do the exhaust through either side. Today we're gonna go ahead and use the right side. Uh, first thing I'm gonna do is take a two and three inch hole saw and drill the hole through the side that I want. Okay. Let's get some of these burrs. All right, now that I have it cut, it goes together pretty easily. All right, I'm gonna take my vent length and I'm going to slide it through the larger hole on this plate. I'm gonna take it and slide it through the inside plate as well, like so. All right, then you take the outside cover that would go on the outside of your house. And you're gonna line it up with the exhaust side. And then this nose piece is going to slide right into the hub opening on the exhaust side. I'm it's applying just, just a little, little bit, bit of lubrication. Of yep. Just to help get past the gasket. All right. It goes in just like that. All right. The intake side is much easier once that's in. All you're gonna do, you're gonna do a reverse flow. You're gonna stick your vent length in, and the male end is gonna to connect to the inside piece there like so. All right, so when it's all together, you can see the exhaust shoots straight out, and the intake will be sucked in through the bottom. All right, now, should you choose to do the fresh air a little differently, we'll take this polypropylene pipe out, and I'm going to take this wall plate out real quick. And I'm going to drill one more hole in this piece, just to widen it a little bit. together one more time real quick. Okay. And now you can take PVC and run it straight through to the end here. So. 